Hello, 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 everyone. Cynthia Toet, Miss Clippy, your gypsy medicine woman and your happiness coach. I hope you're all doing wonderful, doing well, staying happy, <sighs> no matter what else going on around you. <laughs> Just make sure you're staying happy. Make that choice. Make that choice to stay happy no matter what else is going on around you. Let's see what the cards have to say. Yeah, it's telling you to stay in balance no matter what's going on out there. Stay in balance. Leave whatever has been bothering you behind. Leave it behind. All that cup of love and all that energy you've been putting out there. You have to pull it in and keep this this radiant shine here within yourself you can't just keep putting it out there that's what you have to leave behind you have to leave behind the energy flow that you're giving out there too much of that's what you have to leave behind because you need to be balanced and keep that balance within yourself knowing that you have a direction that you're going and you know it's in a good harmony and it's in flow but you have to make sure that you're keeping your energy flow within your own surface. Don't go too far out there. You go too far out there. That's when you start feeling like it starts like taking your energy away from you. We don't want that. We need our energy. We need our strength. Yeah, we do. We do. Yeah. Oh, my goodness. Too many cards fell out. Yeah, I'm nighttime driving. I went to the beach watch the sunset and just pretty much went driving around not really getting out of the car to watch my sunset and let's see what else cards have to say I've had a pretty busy day yeah everything is divinely guided everything is in a plan already it's already written in the book and no trust trust in it know that um, see don't worry about anything. This light right here is coming from the highest priest. Look at that. She's giving you the knowledge, giving you the energy, saying, let it just be because it's a colorful way and this way is exactly the way it's supposed to be. It's being divinely guided in this magical way. And stay calm throughout your day. Stay at peace with who you are. Know that the Lord yeah, <laughs> is leading and guiding your way. Because wants to make sure everybody is protected in this magical way. Yeah, a magical way. Make sure everything's coming to the table whole and complete. Not perfect. You don't have to be perfect. Just um, where you have to be whole and complete and balanced. Where you're... You're taking responsibility for all your feels, making sure you're staying in balance all the time. That it's not because of anybody else doing anything in any which way, shape, or form that you feel out of balance. It's because you decided to bring all that energy that you might be putting out there, you bring that energy inside yourself and say, oh yeah, well, if I think too far out there, it takes me out of balance. So I'm going to make sure if I feel like I'm getting out of balance just as that a teeny bit. I'm going to reel that feeling back in towards me. <laughs> so I'm not uh, giving it out, not giving it away. Not giving it away because, you know, we, we know that there's this divine calling going on. It's being divinely guided. And it's very colorful. It's And she's at peace. She's at ease. It's showing, it's going to uncover your eyes. It's uncovering, it's in the middle, uncovering your eyes. So that's why it's important for you to hold your balance right now. Because you have to, um, it's going to uncover your eyes from feeling any of those lower emotional feels that you felt like you were giving out to anyone or anything too much of. Why? Because it's going to put you on stage. And you need that radiant light to shine to be on that stage because you have a message to share with all those people that are out there in the audience and it is in such an a unique special radiant way it actually helps fill everybody else's spirit up because you are 
full of so much light and so much passion and so much desire that you're able to share back out there to them to fill them up. That's what's being uncovered. Knowing that you're a brighter light and we need to keep you in balance to make sure you can share your story out to the world and keep you in balance, keep your story out into the world. Yep, yep, yep. And why the masculine is taking care of some of those lower feels. They're not as heavy as they used to be because this backpack is full of feathers. It's not full of rocks, but he still wants to take care of some of those feels. Why the, oh, where did that go? I am, oh my goodness, you can come back out. Make sure when you're going forward to look out there. Look how far you've come. Take a moment and really look how far you have come. In order for you to even be able to get up on that stage. To shine that brighter light. Look at there's four lights. It's like a union. It's meant to be. It's divinely guided. Look at it's divinely guided. And it's getting you out of this field to put you in that higher vibrational field. So remember, look back even just three months. Where were you three months? I bet you'll find that out that you grew so much. You've been growing so much so fast you don't even realize how much you've grown. Pause for a moment. Go ahead, take a look. Go ahead and see where you've been in 2021. Just this year. See how far you have grown. Myself, I know I've grown a lot. It's, know that with this is about being at peace with all that you have. Knowing whatever you have, you're going to give it out to the community out there. But you're blessing it. You're making sure you're blessing what it is that you have before you gift it out. So when the people receive it, they receive it already blessed. They receive it with this wholeness with this completeness, with this unconditional loving way. And they know it. They're going, wow, that's so cool. Look at what we got. It came out of nowhere. And she gave it to us through this blessing. Oh, pretty and amazing reading. Oh my goodness, the cards are flying out, I tell you. <laughs> says, um, know that you have handled your lower emotional feelings, the thoughts, the thoughts that create those lower feelings, know that you have managed them. Where you can actually walk, it's like, it's like a tight rope or just a little skinny wood across this waterfall. And she's able to walk across it and she's holding all the ideas that she has and those ideas are floating they're going yeah we got this we got this and she's read, she's learning and reading in the book and seeing where those ideas are going to take her and she's got her notes in there too to know look at confirmation again she's always giving us confirmation right at the right time just know and look at she's got a couple birds that are helping her flying around saying you got this you got this but does she have this cup of love that's coming forward? These are two that are coming together with love. This magical love. This colorful love. This, like, they both filled up their cups in this beautiful way for this love to come together in this magical way. It's so magical. It's so unique. It's so special. They come together with this calmness and the reason why I say that is because 
See, when she's gifting, she's gifting with a blessing, confirmation. And it's from the highest priest, which is peaceful, calm, knowingness, trusting that this is going to happen, that not going to happen, it is happening. Ten of Pentacles, look at the masculine getting gotten whole, complete, feeling solid, feeling content. Next to my dog. <laughs> or your dog. And then the dog goes, Hey, we got this. We got this whole story all put together magically. With this Knight of Wands, look at she's so excited. She's just full of joy. And I look at this card like <coughs> It's like a union, too, because there's four poles sticking up. That's confirmation again for my dog. That this is happening. This is really, really happening. She's full of joy. She's through it. Uh, excitement. Even a horse back there is dancing. Not just a little bit of dancing, but dancing around with G glee, happiness. Like, this is awesome. This is amazing. <laughs> There she goes, letting us know what's awesome and amazing. What's awesome and amazing? The emperor made his move with his peace. He made his move. Oh, there we go again. Because he wants this cup of love. He dealt with his inner child. And whatever he might have went through with his dog when he was younger to come ahead and come forward as the adult to be able to embrace that love that he had with the dog then to again have that love again it's like victory whatever he lost whatever he lost in that love as a child he's able to get it back because he found the light which brought him in the trail for his emotions to be in this loving, unique way. Allowing her to work her gifts, to allow those gifts to come out and shine. Just keep doing your thing, baby. Just keep doing it. Because that's allowing the rest of the story to piece it together as she's just feeling whole, complete, solid, balanced, knowing that everything she did with her gifts brought her this, this contentment, this just feeling so awesome and amazing, but peaceful inside. It's not out of anxiety. But it's out of contentment, out of knowingness, out of, I don't even know what words next, but look how calm she is. And she has everything she ever needed or wanted. She has it all. It's nice to have it all like that. And feel calm inside and not just have it all and just still feeling out of balance and, and, and feeling like you got to run over here and got to do this and got to do that. No, it's you did the work and you know the work you did and you know how you did it and how you did it brought this peaceful feeling inside of yourself. How you did it brought this amazing contentment, this amazing ease, this amazing peace inside. It's like you've been blessed and you know it. Blessings are coming your way for sure, for sure. It says for sure, for sure today. That's what it wants to say. But today's almost over. But well, every day's today, right? <laughs> every day's today. Anything else the cards would like to say? There's a love story in there for sure. 
and we have the masculine that has really gotten grounded and has dealt with his um, lower emotions from the past from when he was a child to bring that love forward the love that he had as a child without all the anxiety without all that um, chaos without all that fear he was able to actually go back and fine-tune and get in to get into that uh, feeling to conquer it to let that lion come out within so he can stand here strong and have his his uh, torch with his light on it knowing exactly what direction he's going knowing exactly going knowing exactly all the work he put into this to allow this beautiful love story to happen all the work that he did to bring his calmness within so he's not in rage anymore now his lion is courageous his lion is strong his lion's not out of balance it's imbalance Look at he he's calm. He's standing there, and the lion and the lion's calm too. He says, "I know exactly what I want, and I'm going after it." Well, what does he want? What's he going after? It's got to be that love story, you know. <laughs> Let's see anything else? Anything else? The cards. Wow. He's wanting to see what he hasn't been able to see wanting to see that story he hasn't been able to see he wants to put illuminate put a light on what's been unknown it's like like she was drowning this it looks like I've never read this card this way. She was drowning. And he wanted her to see the light. So he's courageous enough to make it so she's no longer drowning. But she's full of this radiant love. Like here she's below the water and here she's above the water. And a lot of it has to do with because he was able to get to this spot with himself. So she could get this spot with herself. We got so many queens and kings. Queen and king and the emperor. Queen, king. The highest priest. Pretty cool, pretty amazing. Now this one on the out. I don't really normally read this long. I wonder why it's making me read this long. Well, he's coming forward with his pinnacles he's gotten things all in order he's like he can see this colorful way now that he's been able to see this colorful way he's getting them to order before he, she, she starts to walk away he doesn't want her to walk away from this cup of love so he's hurrying up and getting on his chariot and he goes I'm coming forward because I can see this emotional self that's been released that's being released in such this amazing awesome way look how light that is look how beautiful that is it's almost it's like a door has opened and he's coming after that because he doesn't want her to walk away Lights went off. Get the light on again. There we go. <laughs> Was the show over? Let's see. 
talking about new beginnings. The new beginnings are from fire. They are from action. They are from a lot light, but it is from this peaceful way. Look at she's content. She's calm. These new beginnings are happening, but in this thing, <laughs> very calm way. She knows. She doesn't have to be excited. I meant anxiety. There we go again. Anxiety. She knows she doesn't have to have all that anxiety for this to happen. She knows she can be at peace to allow this to happen. She can be at peace to allow it to happen. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like all the confirmations, all the confirmations has come up in this reading. So she can be at peace while this happens. With, she's in a crystal ball and the light shining all around her. And she's sitting on a pillow knowing she knows exactly what she wants. And she wants to be on top of the world knowing that whatever it is that she wanted, she has completed this mission. She has gotten on top of the world in such a lovely, beautiful way. It doesn't matter what comes her way. It doesn't matter if it's in a square or in a circle or a diamond or a, or a, or a star like If No matter which way it comes, she remains happy. She remains joyful. She remains elated. <laughs> she knows there's this union coming forward. That That's what she's staying elated for. It's going to feel like a circus. It's been a journey. To have this wonderful, beautiful story come forward. In this magical, beautiful way. So we could all get together in this union way. <laughs> and that's all because she decided to operate from the childlike mind. Didn't let anything get in her way. Didn't let anything stop her or bother her. She could feel like she could do anything. She could feel like she could do anything. Look at how excited she is knowing that this journey has been one heck of a journey to find this peaceful, joyful, look at unconditional way. He's with the dog, she's with the cat. That means something to me. There's a masculine out there that has cats and I have the dog. And so the masculine is with my dog and I'm with his cat. <laughs> yeah. yeah, I'm with his cat, that's what I gotta say. Whoa, 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 whoa. In a beautiful, magical way. We like the world to do this in a balanced way. Anything else you would like the collective to know about this story that's been shared so far? I mean, I'm like way over the time I normally read for. Just trust your insights. Trust what you're inside. You have that light that's within. But you can sit there and be patient and wait. And you can always look at what's happened. You can always look at the path and the journey. And you can always feel like you're sitting there floating on top of nothing. You're just floating. <laughs> you're so happy and so excited and so joyful. Let's see what that one is. All right, let's let's make a time limit on this. How about one more card? One more. Well, okay. How about one more follow card? How about that? It says the universe is working very hard behind the scene, and it's been working and working and working. People are putting it together so this light can come out and shine. 
and it is it's working with passion it's working with fire it's climbing over all the obstacles that there ever possibly was to have this ten of cups come forward to have this ultimate love come forward so these two can work together it's been divinely guided to work together And they're enjoying working together and they're so glad that the universe provided this story for them. This is Cynthia Toa, Miss Flippit, your Gypsy Medicine Woman and your Happiness Coach. Please remember to like, share and subscribe. It helps the channel grow. It helps get the message out there to more people because we need hope in this world. We need people to operate from this calm way because when we're operating from this calm way, guess what? We get so much more done because then it's not like our energy is not so full of all that chaotic way. It's like it's calm and when it's calm, it's moving in this magical, beautiful way and you're getting 10 times, 10 times more things done. Yeah, by the end of the day or night, I don't know, I'm in, I'm out up all night. I don't even know when day and night is. I just live. <laughs> but by the time that you lay down to rest, let's say, that you feel like, I got so much done today. I did this and this and this and this. That's crazy how much stuff I got done. Till next time, have a beautiful day. <laughs> and the bottom of the deck was... Here he is with his flowers because he has an off. He's wanting to come forward to this love story. He has his love letter and he has his picnic and his horse. Look at the dogs barking again. <laughs> She's going, yeah, well, how'd you forget that? And the horse back there is dancing too with glee. So it's about time he decided to make an effort and he'd been trying to get over his own stuff too. So it's no problem. I mean, it's not really about time. It's perfectly divinely timed. But I had to add this into the reading because it is part of the story. Till next time.